Hi, it's Christina with the Sisyphean Journal. Um, I saw the breaking news. The Supreme Court has overturned Roe. I find it a little annoying that the news announcer goes that this removes protection, but at least she said that, that the Supreme Court provided to abortion instead of acting like it was protecting human beings of any sort. Um, so we could expect a lot of violence against pregnancy centers because if there is anything that the abortion lobby and abortion enthusiasts can't stand, it's the idea that a woman in a difficult situation will choose something other than abortion. Because post-abortion women tend to need to be validated. And every single time a woman in the aborted woman situation chooses to have her baby, that's kind of, well, you didn't need to have an abortion, did you? Every woman who's able to finish college in spite of pregnancy is a slap in the face to every woman who had an abortion saying she needed to do it to finish college. Ditto for careers. This is, I've said it before, this is why the abortion people hate Amy Coney Barrett and Sarah Palin so much because they had magnificently successful careers and didn't abort a single baby to achieve it, not even one of those yucky Down syndrome babies that they let stay in the house as if it's a people. So um, we are going to get the abortion lobby showing what they're about. First of all, we're gonna get pitching hissy fits. We are gonna get the sky is falling. We are gonna get that every front lawn in a, in a red state is gonna be bedecked with a coat hanger impaled woman. And we're going to get a lot of violence against places that offer women help because they don't want the women to have help. Well, the post-abortion women don't want women to have help because, like I said, every time a woman in their situation chooses to have her baby, that invalidates the decision to abort. And also the abortion uh, lobby and abortion businesses hate it because it's lost business. And if there's anything they can't stand, it's losing business. You have to remember, even if they're a nonprofit, they need to bring in money. They need to sell those abortions. So we're about to see what they're really made of. And it's got nothing to do with helping women. It's got nothing to do with women having choices. It's got everything to do with abortion, 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 and making sure abortions happen. Um, they are going to really show how disgusting they can get and lay low. It's going to be ugly.